What is going on people? It is your boy Daddy Mac and welcome to our final Wi-Fi battle with this team. We're against my Trey KDD, which I think is like kid or something like that, but I'm gonna call you kid. Kid is bringing a really cool team with you. High Dragon really is threatening. He's probably gonna start Grim Snarl, so because of the Grim Snarl, I'm gonna start I'm I, I'm thinking Lantern. Azumarill? Lantern? Ah, uh, probably Lantern. Uh, he's probably gonna set up the screens and what's on and, and mollywop us. So we gotta be careful with that. But he's bringing a really cool team. The Zeror is another really threatening Pokemon. Raichu is cool to see. Panurchin is cool to see. So he's. It's, it, I feel like this is a little bit of a electric terrain team, and it makes sense because the Halucha gets him burdened, probably holding the electric seed, given that he has the Panurchin. Raichu, which becomes the ultimate, the, the fastest Pokemon that's going to be in the battlefield with the terrain up. And his team is just really threatening, and I'm not ready to get Mollywop. We've been doing so good with this team. Before, I love your lead card. It's pretty dope. Make sure you guys leave a like on this video if you enjoy it. Comment down below on who the MVP is going to be, most valuable Pokemon, and subscribe to my channel. For more Pokemon Sword and Shield videos. So we got the Pinarchin here. Lantern is going to be a key Pokemon to this. Because we don't want to take any, any electric type of attacks on any of our Pokemon. So we're running Volt Absorb for obvious reasons here. What I'm going to do here is... Um, you're probably going to switch, right? I'm going to Discharge just to see what my opponent is going to do. Just to see. Just to see what... Now, Panurchin does get this new move, which is, um, what is this move called? It, it only works, well, it, it doubles, or it increases within electric terrain. I don't remember the move, man. I don't rem I know it's terrain pulse, but there's also another move specific to electric terrain. I don't, rising voltage, rising voltage. Panurchin gets rising, rising voltage, which is actually really, really good in electric terrain. I'm gonna go discharge here. He's probably gonna go for the rising voltage to see what I'm doing here or toxic spikes I don't got any poison types Or a rapid spinner at that. That's not good. I Kind of want to scald now. I, I want to see how much damage scald and uh, Discharge do against the Pernurchin just to see and scald is a better move and we get the burn. That's good news Rising voltage we're bolt absorbed though. So that's good news for us. That's really good news for us. Um, scald again, maybe? Yeah, I'm gonna Scald again. Because if he wants to switch into a physical attacker, it's gonna get burned. Well, at least I think it's gonna get burned. I don't know. But it's gonna get burned. I'm gonna try to burn it, is what the right verbatim for that is. Okay, so what are you gonna do, KDD? Her, her team is awesome. It, it is awesome. I, I love her team. I'm kind of curious to see what, what it's going to do, but I'm kind of nervous also. I'm going to Scald again. Hopefully knocks this thing out. It does. Good job, Lantern. It's a crit. I'm going to say that mattered. I'm going to say that mattered. So Panurchin didn't really do much except for this, uh, except set up the terrain. Who's going to come out next? Who's this? Raichu comes out. I'm not, a, I'm not too scared because... I'm assault vested, but Raichu's death now it's something to be afraid of for sure. <laughs> That's scary. That little laugh is kind of creepy. Alright, so attack raises sharply. I'm gonna scald here. Hopefully get some something going. Burn, maybe? No? Okay, I'm gonna go scald here. You're probably gonna hit me with the uh psychic attack. That would be the optimal play. A psych a psy shock. We're going down, boys. This is not what I wanted. Let's turn! We live. We live it barely. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go into this armory. I'm gonna predict a side shock here. And then I'm gonna try to predict an electric type attack from this Raichu. Try, try, try. Side shock. Come on, Skarmory. Live this, please. Okay, we live it. We're living that easy. We're easily living that now. 
He's probably gonna go for either a rising voltage or just um, a thunderbolt or something like that. And hopefully we can catch him with the lantern. Hopefully, hopefully. I really hope we can catch the electric type attack here. We get poison, which is not good. Surf. Ah, oh, man, he caught me with that. He caught me with that surf. That's fine. Um, Righteous just gonna have to go down with the. Oh, it's gonna go down with the life orb, anyways. Okay. With that information there, I think Darmanitan is a good play. Or switch the terrain with the Rillaboom. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna switch the terrain with the Rillaboom here. Who is this? Halucha? Halucha. I'm gonna go Rillaboom, and we're gonna switch this terrain. Switch this terrain because we do not want this. That gets rid of the electric seed on Alucha, which is good. And then, I think Azumarill is good. Yeah, we're gonna go Azumi! Azumi the Azumarill. If you guys watch Naruto, you know who I'm referencing. Oh man, this poison's racking up, and that's not good. That's no bueno. We go for the taunt, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. We're gonna take some poison damage, which is not good at all. And I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna play rough here. I think that's a good move for us. Azumarill is really good because it, it knocks out the Grim Snarl and the uh, Dragon, but I and it also does a lot of damage against the Alucha, but it's also gonna do damage to his his, his uh, Zero Aura. It's probably a shiny Zero Aura. Is my guess. I had a really good feeling he was gonna go Halucha, and we capitalized by going into uh, Rillaboom. Zero Aura comes out. Come on, come on, Azumi. Hit this. We we miss. We miss. I kind of had a feeling we were gonna miss. To be honest. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. And then we're taking poison damage. That is not good. Um, Executor's the play here. Because he's gonna go for the electric type attack. He's gonna go for the electric type attack. I have a feeling. Or she. Well, I assume it's there or as a boy, but. But. Alright. Azumi switches out. Here comes the Executor. Hopefully, we can tank that electric type attack. We're poisoned. Our whole team is gonna suffer from poisons. Uh, from poison. Bolt switch is optimal. That's really good. Don't go Halucha. Please don't go Halucha. I'll hit it with an extra sensory if you do. You've been warned. Does Grim Snarl get? Uh, let me let me see. Does Grim Snarl get the search or not the search? The terrain. I hope it does. And Thunder Punch, Thunder Wave, High Dragon comes out. That's kind of good and kind of bad because if this thing nasty plots, we're in trouble. We're in big trouble if this thing nasty plots or goes for the substitute. So I'm going to Draco. I have no choice but to Draco here. No choice. Executor looking high up there. Looking way high. All right. U turn. Not bad. That does some damage. It's, it's gonna pop our citrus berry this next turn. Who are you gonna go to? Grimmsnarl. Oh, that Grimmsnarl is not a good. Not good. Yeah, that's the Grimmsnarl. Good play. Good, good play. That's a great play, actually. Get a little bit of help because of the uh, terrain. And then we lose a little bit. And that pops our citrus berry. So hopefully we can live an attack from this Grimmsnarl. Hopefully. Come on, harvest it. Yes, boys. Okay, now what we're gonna do is hit this thing with the leaf storm. Because the terrain is up. Leaf storm is it should do a, a pretty good amount of damage. Unless this thing goes for a what's that attack called? Um the light screen. It might even knock it out. I'd 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 say it almost knocks it out. I would say it does. Light screen. Okay. 
That is okay. I'm gonna go Leaf Storm here. Doesn't knock it out, but it does some damage. It for sure does some damage. Uh, I cannot help but think we're gonna we're gonna lose this battle. I'm trying to stay positive, but I, I feel like we're gonna lose this, and that's not that's not good. The terrain disappears, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna switch into the Rillaboom. And then I'm gonna try. So Rillaboom already has status, so he can't hit us with the Thunder Wave. I'm gonna go for a Swords Dance. Yeah, I'm gonna go Swords Dance. And then I'm gonna Dynamax. So we're gonna be seeing Rillaboom for the fight for, for the first time. And the last time, probably. Alright. Switch out Grimmsnarl. If you value Grimmsnarl, switch out. Uh, take some damage get a little bit of it back uh, uh, Or not or not. All right sword dance. I'm gonna sword dance here again After a sword dance glassy glide does more than a choice banded rillaboom Which is why were you writing sword dance? Come on, okay withdraw that's kind of good. That's kind of good and then here comes the high dragon who's probably gonna dynamax I hope it doesn't Dynamax, but it probably will. Okay. That's kind of good. That's kind of good. We're going to take some more damage because of the poison. Rillaboom, I am so sorry. All right, here we go. We're going to max Knuckle here. We're going to max Knuckle. We're at plus two. It might even knock this thing out. I know there's a Reflect up, but I think Reflect is like a plus one. I think I, I have a feeling I could be wrong all right we're dynamaxing he's probably not dynamaxing Rilla boom here we go here we go Rilla boom that real boom looks awesome flamethrower oh no Okay. It comes down to this in all reality. I can't max guard. We didn't need to max guard. Who needs max guard? Who needs max guard? It's a crit. Did that matter? Did that matter? Light screen is up. We're at plus two. And it's a critical hit, which is um, big. That's huge. That is huge. Halucha still in the back. Halucha still in the back, which is not good. So Rillaboom is probably going to go down, to be honest, because Halucha outspeeds us. Unless it goes for a high jump kick. Um, what are you going to do, kid? What are you going to do? KDD, Zaraora. That's a good play. Zaraora will probably knock us out, to be honest. Um. Uh, I kind of wish I didn't Dynamax, but I felt like I, I feel like I had to and it looks like he's drumming the beat All right close combat good information Good information we're gonna go back under under uh, Okay Oh, this is kind of stressful um I feel like I need Rillaboom. So we're gonna get off of the Dynamax and we're gonna switch into the Executor. We're gonna try that out. See how that works out for us. Because I feel like we really need the priority on the Rillaboom. Close combat. Does a good amount. Our, it's gonna pop our Citrus Berry. I was gonna pop our citrus berry. High dragon, I feel like was the biggest threat, and now that's gone. The next biggest threat is the Zero Aura. So we gotta be careful with it. Can we harvest? Can we harvest our berry back? Because we're gonna need it right now. No. Okay. That's not good. Leaf Storm. That's our next best attack. Leaf Storm. We're playing really well for his for her team to be really good. 
I feel like I at least play rough. Miss? Yes, boy, that's payback. That is payback. So now, now Darmanitak could come in, outspeed this thing, and knock it out. Can we please, 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 please? No, we, we're not harvesting. I guess you don't want to harvest for some reason. Azumarill, I kind of need, I feel like. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like we do. Uh, I think we're gonna get let executor go down here though. He did his he did his job. I think my executor is a boy I don't know But he did his job he or she did his job or her job This is a battle This is a battle play rough knocks us out Knocks us out Rightfully so Light screen wears off. I'm gonna go into Darmanitan here. Big boy Darm is coming out Big boy Darm is coming out Which is kind of crucial We need we need big boy Darm and then we're gonna hit this thing with a Flare blitz I think we're gonna hit this thing with a flare blitz Dynamaxing I mean, I outspeed. In that case, my best move was to go for the Earthquake. Oh, man. Our best move was to go for the Earthquake. I just messed it up. I feel like I messed it up. I feel like I messed it up. Okay, we didn't mess it up. Good. Dynamax got to waste. He probably thought he was gonna outspeed me. I think this is the first time he saw or she saw my Darmanitan. Okay. Darmanitan takes some damage because of the flood blitz and the poison, of course. Reflect wears off, so his best move, her best move, would probably go be to go into the Grim Snarl. Set up the reflect again. That would be optimal. That would be optimal. Yeah. Here he comes, the Grim Snarl. I'm gonna flare blitz. And even with the reflect, hopefully that is enough to knock out. Probably not because he probably, uh, she probably has some defense, defensive investment on this Grim Snarl. All right, Flare Blitz. That's a lot of damage. I think we're still going to switch out. We're going to switch out because our mana is kind of useful. It's very useful, actually. So switch out. We're going to go into Skarmory here. Go out into Skarmory. We're playing well. We're playing really, really good. Sucker Punch, rightfully so. Okay, I see that. I see you trying to predict, make make a couple of reads here. And Stealth Rock. We're going to Stealth Rock here. Very, very late game Stealth Rock. For the Halucha. For the Halucha. That's why we're going Stealth Rock. Okay, no paralysis. This is a good battle. This is a really, really good battle. I think the biggest problem is that she let her terrain setter go down too early. Because this is a terrain team. This is a terrain team and the terrain setter went out too early. All right. We're four to two right now. We want to knock out this Grim Snarl because of the fact that it can set up the Reflect again. So I kind of tried to stall a little bit. Just a little bit. Man, my team's putting in the work. I'm really glad. I'm, I, I love this team. This is the best team I've used on this channel. It's the, it's the best team by far that we've used on this channel. So we do threaten this thing with the... Uh, what is it called? Uh, Brave Bird. Why am I going there? Reflect one more turn. Okay. We're gonna Brave Bird here. Try to try to threaten this thing a little bit. Battle is canceled. We win. Oh my goodness. That was a battle. That was a battle. She had me in the ropes for a really long time. We just really played our turns really carefully. And I think that was the biggest thing of the, of the game. I'm gonna take your Lee card because that battle was amazing. But... Thank you guys so much for watching.
I really appreciate your time. Make sure you guys leave a like if you enjoyed this battle. Let me know in the comment section down below who the MVP, most valuable Pokemon of the of these bat of this battle was, and subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Sword and Shield videos. It's your boy Daddy Mac. I will see you guys next time.